the first announcement for tonight is the breaking of your fast. We do not believe that um, a fasting has ended until you've broken the fast. What does it mean to break the fast? It means eat. Now, this is a fast. Many of you in the family, you've done fasts that are more tedious than this one. Because this one, you could drink water, you could drink juice, um, you could drink tea, you could drink even whatever you wanted to drink within the day. You could do the liquid within the day and then the evening, you do the Daniel fast. That's what we said. But then, how you break the fast is very important. Somebody's like, Mama, you didn't say we're breaking with the Daniels, but we said that. We say it's preferred that you don't go eating all the heavy meat and all the things that will hurt you. Eat some fish, eat veggies. After you, you, you finish um, your fast, it will help you. Use this opportunity to build your immune system. Use it to build your insight. How you break a fast is important. You want to be able to pray tonight. You want to be able to study. You want to pray tomorrow. That's the reason you want to break your fast wisely. How are you going to do that? Please drink liquid. For those who did not drink anything, do not go to eating without drinking. Number two, if you can take it gradually by one, eating fiber first. You can get fibers from fruit or you can get it from veggies. Don't go to your fufu and arrow immediately. Don't go to a buy immediately. Um, Nigerians, what, what is the good heavy food? Where's Uncle Ify? Tell me. What's the good heavy food that Nigerians can rush to and it will cause problem? Don't eat anything heavy. Make sure you eat something light. Progress as progress in the heaviness of your food. It's okay to eat little bites. It's very healthy to eat little bites after a fast than to carry the whole bowl and say, my breakfast, my lunch, and my dinner. All that I have, I have to put in my system right now. Mm -mm, mm -mm. You're gonna hurt. You're gonna hurt your system. Don't do that. Um, the next announcement um, is about posting. Please, please, I beg you. We do not practice mediocrity in this family. Now, if you hear me talk every time I talk, I will never call us a church. We are not a church. If you want to do drama, please go do it with your pastor. I will never come ask you what you're doing with your pastor. Pastors do that. I'm not a pastor. I'm a teacher. I'm a trainer. We cannot be in the fast and you're out there posting on the platforms. Now, this is the assumption that everyone on the platform understand. You have an understanding of our values. Our value system are very straightforward. If it's a fasting, we we'll call ourselves a family because families do together everybody type it in the chat box please thank you families do together means we do everything together if it's fasting everyone is involved especially be leaders please i beg you if you're a leader i never choose you to be a leader you proved you can lead that's why you're a leader we don't have we don't we don't elect leaders people rise into leadership by how the act how they show us they can lead. Everyone in this family that's leading, you're leading an area where you prove you could be a leader. And when you begin to prove you don't want to be a leader, we will not keep you. That's the truth. We will not. We love you so much and we will not allow you practice mediocrity here. Miss mm -mm. Ivan, so can you delete a leader? Very well deleted. I mean, not deleting. Deleted in the past. Because I tell you all the truth before we get there. It is a no, no, no to post on the platforms when we are in the fasting period. If you like, I don't care if somebody died. We will cry with you. We will roll with you after the fast. You're like, isn't that cool, my sister? If you know the quality of the devil, you will find time like this to build yourself. The fasting period in the Bill family is a period to appreciate the Lord for what he has done in the month. That's why we always have two days or one day in the old month and at least two days in the new month. All of this is to thank him for what he's done and to prepare ourselves to receive the instructions for the new month. No, I know you're very wise, okay? You're very intelligent. You can lead your life all by yourself. But some of us, we depend on the least word that he will give us. What is this all about? Posting. 
do not post on the platform during fasting. If you catch anybody posting on the platform, don't respond to their post. Don't. I'm recording this because I'll send it tonight. In the next two hours, this video will be very alive for everyone to listen to it again. And you cannot absent from meetings and expect us to take the responsibility on your behalf. No. So on the platforms, no posting. Except it is related to the fast. For example, Minister Ivai describes on Mama Scott, they will always have announcements. They can post that. Number two, if you listen to a message and it really blessed you, talk to me about it. Or look at it and you can post that. We're not saying no posting, absolutely no. We're saying posting that will help people maximize their fast. Now, this is for how many days? Four days. You want to tell me you can't be that disciplined not to post anything in four days, just four? After that, post everything you want. If you went to Hawaii during this fast, come back, wait. After the fast, post. We'll go to Hawaii. We, do, we will even we will enjoy the Hawaii more than you who went there physically. That's the truth. Why are we saying this thing? Is it control? No, I'm helping you live a better life. If you don't know how to be disciplined, I tell you, no matter how gifted you are, if you're in discipline, you can't go anywhere. I have my friend doctor here. He can tell you how to become a doctor. It doesn't matter how naturally gifted you are. If you don't discipline yourself, you will never be that doctor you, you think you can be. I have great businessmen here among us. Ask them, they will tell you, no matter how many business ideas you have, if you're not disciplined, you will never enjoy the privileges of that idea. So it's about helping us to be disciplined. It's about helping us to know exactly what life really is about. It's about focus. It's about diligence. It's about doing that which you need to do per time, per time to get the results that you want to get. The next announcement is always make sure during a fast to revisit Isaiah 58. Isaiah 58 is not an Old Testament scripture. It's a kingdom scripture. It's one of those chapters in the Bible that will never pass away. Somebody's like, all the world will not pass away. I mean, in the practicality and the doing of it. This one right here. Somebody said, Jesus fulfilled everything. No, there are kingdom kingdom scriptures that Jesus fulfilled and you and I must enforce. And this is one of them, Isaiah 58. Make sure you visit it. Make sure every day, if possible. If you cannot read it, listen to Isaiah 58. Remind yourself what a true fast is so you can do the whole thing so you can get the benefit. I think that's the announcement on my end. Um, you will definitely get your scriptures to study immediately after this. You can go ahead and post it. Mr. Iba, you will still be in, in order. Uh, um, the scriptures for tomorrow's studies is ready. She will post it. And if you invited somebody, please do them justice to send them the scripture. The questions remain the same. I hear somebody asking, is it the same question? Yes, it's the same question. And if you are studying and you think the questions need to be tweeted, it's very fine. I'm very open. I don't believe I know everything. To send me a question. Ask me. I think we should change this part. And we can always tweet for that particular um, scripture for that day. Um, but to the best of my understanding, the scriptures are good for all the days. The same, the questions are good for all um, the four days of the fast. All right questions before we um, go to our sharing that's the announcement we're praying three times a day yes tomorrow morning 5 a.m um, tomorrow 11 a.m and tomorrow 4 p.m now it's all in central standard time if you cannot meet up that's okay make sure you don't miss the 4 p.m that's the biggie you don't want to miss that one because that's where we we do like we've just done this evening okay